Hey folks, Dr. Bob McCauley. Um, I had a customer inquire the other day about, she came up, she said, I have these parasites and I've been tested for them and I know I have them. And what do you suggest? Well, I, I know I can get rid of parasites. So let me tell you, first of all, uh, stop eating. Stop eating and fast. Stop, you know, eating all this food as people always do. Every day, they, you know, you got to just, first of all, you got to kind of think about, you want to starve out the parasites, don't feed them. And, um, but you got to fast because you want the digestive cl uh, tract clear and you want the uh, blood clear. And if you just keep eating and eating, you're never going to get anywhere. That's, that's the truth. So that's the first thing you got to do, stop eating. People really, you know, they ask me, gee, I got, I'm under the weather, I don't feel good, what should I do? Stop eating, and then I'll tell you what to do next. Now, while you're not, if you can go on a fast, like if you, you can get rid of these parasites really pretty quickly, but people just don't want to stop eating. They want to keep feeding themselves and feeding themselves. I do recommend a full-spectrum mineral like I sell here full spectrum that's got like 26 different minerals in it there's the, you want at least your electrolytes but I take these every day myself but the electrolytes you know that's potassium and calcium and magnesium and this kind of thing and uh, you know you get that in Gatorade except Gatorade is garbage so stay away from that stuff but um, any rate so stop eating and then here's what you do and so it's, if, you, if you really can't stand it I mean just do it in the morning but at least don't eat for a couple hours afterwards. But anyway, see if you can go a day without food. And, uh, you know, first thing I recommend is um, papaya seed powder. Papaya seed powder is famous all over the world. South America is well known uh, for ridding the body of parasites. So you do that. Um, and uh, even before you do that, I would recommend bismuth, liquid angstrom bismuth. So this is bismuth is a mineral. This is what they put in, put in pe uh, Pepto-Bismol. And you take about a capful, and you take, and you can swallow it, and uh, that'll kill the bacteria in your, um, in your gut, and your digestive tract. Things like H. pylori, famous for killing that stuff, but it'll kill almost any kind of bacteria. Um, H. pylori is where you get stomach ulcers from. The other thing you're going to do is silver, liquid angstrom, silver. Silver has been used for thousands and thousands of years. Uh, you know, the Romans used to use silver suture and they knew uh, it would sew you up and then you wouldn't get, uh, you know, infection from that. And so it's been used uh, in the Old West. Uh, they would used to put the silver dollar in the milk or silver dollar in the uh, water and it would disinfect it. So silver's been used for, and that you're going to hold in your mouth the silver as long as you possibly can. It'll go into the body through the sublingual duct under the tongue and right into the bloodstream that'll disinfect um, your your um, digestive tract so i wrote a whole book on silver called silver no i have it here right now the miracle mineral the end of infectious disease and i had meningitis which is a killer and it's a mortality it's really kills a 21 percent 21 so one out of five people die of it uh, i didn't have any yeah, I was really knocked down on it. Any normal person would have went to the hospital, but not Dr. Bob. So, uh, but I got through it, and then it came back, and I had a little bit of silver. Told the story many times, and it knocked it right out within a couple of years because my body had uh, kind of built up the antibodies to the uh, meningitis. We got that from the mosquito. That was in 2012. So the other thing I'm going to recommend, so you've taken your, your two, your bismuth, your silver, and your papaya seed powder and then I would recommend the parasite killer which has got uh, 11 different uh, powders in it you know they're all natural everything's all natural um, but you can look it up I won't, I won't bore you with it right now but um, it's got all sorts of you know uh, episoda and all, all this stuff that kills viruses bacteria yeast mold and fungus and this is how you're going to get rid of all these infectious agents in your digestive tract um, for instance, uh, if you have any serious disease such as cancer, well, you, you're full of these parasites of all kinds, bacteria, viruses, yeast, mold, and fungus, along with these larger parasites um, all throughout your digestive tract. Uh, another thing I would recommend during that time, um, I would uh, recommend uh, that you do an enema. Um, in particular a coffee enema and a reason I would recommend for that so you get the lower the colon emptied out because you know if you get parasites if you're always 
uh, backed up, you always got constipation, you probably have some parasites. You certainly do not have any digestion whatsoever. So I would uh, highly recommend that one. And uh, so do a coffee enema. You know, it's, it's so cheap, right? You just get coffee, you cool it down, you get an enema bottle, make sure it's caffeinated coffee, you give yourself an enema, wait 10 minutes, you're going to really want to go to the bathroom. And then, you know, you can, you can do that. I mean, if you're really backed up or something, you could do it a few times. Um, but uh, if you've got constipation, you've got a serious problem. That's what it comes down to. And uh, I'll tell you what to do at the end of all this. But those are the agents that are going to kill everything in the body. So um, that's, that's kind of how you start that. And um, people say, how long should I do it for? Well, you know, I don't, I don't know how, many, how sick you are, how many parasites you have in your body. I don't know if you're a total mess. But um, you could repeat this thing, uh, what I just told you here, taking the papaya seed powder, the parasite killer, the bismuth and the silver. You could do that, you know, in the morning. You could do it again in the afternoon. Don't eat anything. If you eat something, you're kind of wasting your time by doing this because it really, it's got to get, be able to get at you know, these viruses, bacteria, yeast, mold, and fungus. And again, if you're really sick and you've got a lot of parasites, it's going to take a while to get rid of them. But if, but, and again, if you really have, um, you know, uh, you go on a serious fast and you, you clear the digestive tract and you clear the blood, um, it's one of the healthiest things you can possibly do, of course, is fast. But that's what you got to do. Um, and then stop eating and then just clear the body of, of all this stuff. And uh, say you're going to go on a religious fast for a day or for two days or three days. I, 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 I fasted over Easter last year. And, uh, you know, I'm not trying to brag, but it didn't bother me one bit. Um, I just stopped eating. Uh, I stopped eating on a Thursday. It was my last meal. I started eating again on Sunday. I mean, I, I didn't get any, you know, detoxification symptoms, headaches, rash, diarrhea, fatigue. But I live a pretty healthy diet to begin with, so I don't have those issues. Um, so that's, that's how you get rid of the parasites, and that's how you get rid of all these infectious agents. And if you expect to ever be healthy, you really need to do this. Now, at the end of it all, when you're really done fasting and you really put, wait two or three hours to kind of get this out of your system, at least two or three hours, maybe more, and then have a probiotic, the friendly bacteria, and that will reintroduce all the friendly stuff back into the body. So there's a, there's a couple other things. I don't have my dissolve, dissolve uh, um, bioactive silicate. Uh, is another really good thing to take during that time. Um, can you, you, you can't, I don't want to say you can't take too much of it, but um, you're not going to hurt yourself if you keep doing it and doing it. If you're fasting, stay mineralized, and you're going to see you're going to get on top of these things and get your health back. If you've got a lot of parasites, you've got all these infectious agents in your body, you're in bad shape. You really need to clear yourself out. And this is Dr. Bob's method of doing just that. And uh, I hope this was helpful. And we'll see you guys next time. I just want to remind you to buy my books. I've got uh, eight books on natural health, uh, one on cancer, one on silver, one on water, some other ones. I've been writing books now, believe it or not, 25 years. And uh, go to Amazon.com. Or Audible, I've got them all on Audible, or go to BobMcCauleyBooks.com. But buy my books, please, and review them.